first of all, one of, and, and I heard John talk about it and you were like, I don't know what to do with that because mm -hmm. if I say, well, I'm not gay, then it's like, well, am I saying it's bad to be mm -hmm. gay, right? And, and that's what's implied, you know, in the internalized homophobia in our society. But what I find really, uh, when I was listening to that, first of all, I hadn't never heard about that. And then I was like mm -hmm. listening to you naming the reasons mm -hmm. because you, you know, cross your legs, mm -hmm. you, you like are mm -hmm. conscious of how much space mm -hmm. you take. You have great hair, mm -hmm. you're calm, you're mm -hmm. nice, you're sensitive. And I was like, women love that. <laughs> like, like women are actually, those are all things that women are very attracted to. So who says that that's gay? But right? I also think most men would spend an extra little bit of time on their hair if they didn't, if they yeah. grew up in a house where their dad didn't tell them to stop fussing on their hair. Like my there dad could see me in the mirror playing with my hair and, and talking about my hair and he would never say anything about it. It was just mm, like, that's, that's a great point. You know, a lot, I know friends.